telekinetic powers? Hey, I'll call him Brainy for nothing! <laughs> I am still feeling the butt gut. Ow! Uh, I think I broke a branch or two. Hmm. I don't think we can beat these brainy broads. <laughs> Lou is right. If we want to win this, then we're going to have to pull out the big guns. Yes. And with our combined big guns, we will be doing the mass destruction and the utter annihilations. Oh, yeah. You know it. Come on, ladies. It's time to tighten those laces and punch some faces! <laughs> now you speak in my language! Derby is forever, forever girls! Uh-oh, I'm sorry! Looks like you got a little rig rush! <laughs> Watch your step! I am the jammer! You get the jam! You get the jam! And you get the It's Francis. Whatever, it's the only way. Let's roll! So I'm really going to hire a clown? Oh, no, 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 please, please do not do it. I beg of you. A clown! A clown it is. Attention, Titans. I know we're all having a good time, but the <clears throat> clown is here. <laughs> Kitty stuff. Boo! I told you, you're too old for clowns. No, it's him. This is not the way we remember his act. Guys, this is a classic clown act. Look at the shoes, the nose, the makeup. No way. This clown is for kids. Yes, clowns are for kids. When I was a kid, clowns were way cooler. They had depth and meaning. This clown is garbage. Kids today don't know what they're missing. You know, maybe we can fix him. Make him as cool as he used to be. Clowns were never cool. You're letting nostalgia cloud your memory. Guys, kids' entertainment is not something to be messed with. It's sacred. I worry that altering this clown could have disastrous consequences. Sorry, Mama, but we're making this clown cool again. Uh <laughs> Man, look at this clown. I know, he looks like some kind of clown. What a disgrace. But we'll just dress him up like we remember him. I don't really remember what he looked like, bro. Just that he was cool. Then let's make him cool! With science! Just sign this here waiver stating that we can do anything we want to your mind, body, and spiritual being. Thanks, bro.
clown's gone, Star. It's safe to come out. <laughs> you guys! We made our clown cool again. Keep him away from me. Check it! <laughs> in exchange for providing us power for our technology, we have replaced them in your food chain with a nutritious meat-free substitute. Wait, you mean meaty meat is actually tofu? Not tofu, new food. Tofu comes from your planet soybeans. New food comes from me. Oh, gross, dude. Who are you? You know, Francis, it's a shame it has to end this way. Your magnificent cows are mine! My collector ships are dealing with your friends as we speak. This ship is fueled, and once we leave orbit, kaboom, shapoo, swagga bugga bang! <laughs> through that door. Tara, these fools don't even see the double cross that's coming. <laughs> Tara! Why would you think I'm gonna double cross you? You can't even trust me for one second! Whoa, I was just asking for you to get us through that door. Oh! <laughs> it's reinforced! Can we send her back to the trash hole? Not bad. All I had to do was imagine it was your face. Girls, just focus on those milkshakes! Confetti! It is the empty! I don't get it. They were supposed to be right here. Yes, they were supposed to be. <gasps> Fortunately, I was warned of your arrival. Warned? What are you talking about? <gasps> Terror. You fools! I finally have my revenge! 
revenge. It was so obvious and you couldn't see it. I mean, how long does someone have to rub their hands together before you realize they're up to no good? We just thought your hands were cold. I even made you the yarn mittens. Cute, but my hands are evil, not cold. Evil. <laughs> You're trapped too, genius. You think I care? This is a big upgrade over the trash hole. Well, you're crazy if you think we're staying. Do not waste your energy. I've created this cell specifically to counteract your powers. I hope you like it, for it will be your tomb. <laughs> so we broke into our own prison cell? Awesome. I've got it! We wait until animal us evolve into humans. Then they will... Grab a time machine! And... Come back here to rescue us! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> ah, glad you made it. We need your help getting out of here! That's it! Now, hit that release button! Gubba? No, no! The other button! Gubba? Yes, that's the one! Gaga? Yeah, yeah, yeah! Gubba Gubba? Yeah, yeah! Zaga Zaga! Yeah, but I can't see anything either. Makes it even more dangerous. I can use my cybernetics to see, but would I then not lose my humanity? Robin, there is something I need to tell you. Not now. We have a job to do. In case we don't come back, I want to say it's been an honor serving with you all. Showtime. Everything is ready. Missile is go for launch. Not on our watch. Titan! Whoa, you guys look serious. We're done playing games with you, Hive. Really? That's too bad. <laughs> Serious hero work, Titans. Aqualad. We came here to clean up your mess, but it looks like you have everything under control. Perhaps you can admit you misjudged us. You do look pretty serious now. I just worry. Is it too serious? Too serious? You don't understand what it's like to be half machine, half man! Let's get out of here, Titans. There's a life and death emergency in the Mooka Mooka sector we have to deal with. And something tells me this is only the beginning. Can you believe Aqualad thought we were too serious? Not now, Robin. I need to have a little talk with my friend, Cyborg. What's this all about? You know what this is about. You drink my juice, and I want to know why. I was thirsty. You knew that was my juice. My name was on the carton. So? It's drink or be drinking. If I can't trust you with my juice, then maybe I can't trust you at all. Well, that makes two of us. Trust is a two-way street, hombre. Hey, drink it up. It was just juice. Easy for you to say! It wasn't your juice! Guys, the monster in me is feeding on your anger. I don't know who I am anymore! Snap out of it! You're Raven! Am I? Or am I a monster? Freak! I don't think I can be a part of this team anymore! <laughs> what is happening to our team? It's too late, Star. He knew what he was doing when he drank the juice! guy with 2% brain power. That beast boy is gone. I'm using 80% of my brain now. Check this out. Whoa, telekinesis? Yep, that's what happens when you use the extra percentages of your brain. I can do this too. What? Whoa! So much brain power! But not enough! 
Hold up, I gotta do something real quick. <laughs> oh, snap! What up, monkey man? Let's touch fingers. <laughs> Sick. Ah! Where'd you go, dude? On a journey through my own DNA to the beginning of time. Me and a monkey man touched fingertips, and then I saw all the secrets of the universe! Now I'm using 95% of my brain, and I'm going to turn into a computer! I do not understand what is the happening! That's because you only use 10% of your brains! If you was like me, you could touch monkeys and be computers too! Beastie, you gotta lock it up, man! This is too much power! It ain't enough! I'm about to get to 100%! Oh, then what will you do? Eliminate reality. We have to do something! Once he gets to 100%, we won't be able to stop him! Titans, go! Puzzle. Beast Boy. What have you done? I removed all distractions so I can finally find the hidden picks. You gotta restore reality, dude! Not until I finish the puzzle, bro. I can see. I can see! Rocket ship! Beach ball! Feather! Broccoli! Come on, little buddy, one more! You can do it! You gotta be kidding me, it's right there! Look, it is in the- No, no hints! I'm gonna do it myself, even if it takes forever. <laughs> A dolphin! <laughs> oh yeah! Absolutely not! Now get your onesies back on! Aww. Remember, Titans, our priority is Darkseid. So what? We just have to sit here bored? These space adventures are never boring. This ship has a multitude of gentle, intellectual sci-fi activities to tantalize the mind. Follow me. We can meet our evil doubles in the Reflection Universe. We are the evil versions of you. You can tell by our facial hair. Facial hair be so evil, yo. The more ha 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 ha. The sci-fi concept of parallel universes and opposite versions of ourselves. Tell me that doesn't get you all fired up. Pass. Look at these adorable alien creatures. Who wants to listen to their soothing purr? Oh yes, that's some good purring. Pass. We can study the habits of space babes. They look exactly like humans, but they're green. The past. I'm actually uh, <clears throat> kind of down with this. Me too. I was also green as it were. Pass. The pass. I suppose no one wants to become immersed in a virtual reality hologram chamber, limited only by your imagination? Ooh, that actually sounds cool. Really? You think something on this space adventure sounds cool? Oh yeah, boy, we love some virtual realities. Great. Then prepare to enter a world of wonder. Computer, recreate 19th century London. Come on, man! What? You can create anything imaginable, and you pick 19th century London? The London?! I'm so mad right now! This is an opportunity to adopt carefully cultivated personas in order to solve the murder of Lady Hathaway. I'm Lord Bismarck Wellington, a moderately successful textile manufacturer. <laughs> How about we do something interesting instead? Yo, 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 computer, listen up. Please, everyone get into character. Over there is our main suspect. <laughs> if we can't stop him, he will get away with this. Raven, what are you doing? Don't worry about it. <laughs> ah! 
Oh, come on! Do something romantic already! Uh, okay. Uh, mm. <laughs> uh, this way. Okay. So, uh, what you thinking about? Oh, it is even more of the romantics than I ever made the dreams of! This is my jam, yo! <gasps> you hear that? He's playing your song, girl! Why is my song on the radio? It's blowing up the charts like three sticks of TNT! Boom, boom, boom! That's what's up! You gots to feel good's inspiring a hit song, Mama! Yay, so great. What's wrong, Ray? You took something very special to me and kinda gave it away to strangers, but whatever. No, 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 Mama! I held it up to let the love I have for you make the world a better place. Come on, girl. Let me show you some things. Check it, Mama. Your song is bringing the peoples together and the animals, too. Even Sticky Joe's feeling it. You're the man, Sticky Joe. Look at all the happiness your song has brought into the world. Hmm. I guess it's nice. Ha! And you didn't want me to fiddle with it. But you fiddled with it anyway. I told you, sometimes you gots to fiddle. Well, you really fiddled things up. I knows. So now that you're cool and not upset about the song anymore, it's probably a good time to tell you I'm going out on tour. What? You know, a tour. Traveling the country and playing the song for huge crowds. So I'm supposed to stay here while you go sing my song to thousands of people? Ooh. This is the relationship drama I was the hoping for. It's finally getting good. So very, very juicy. Hey, move. I can't see. I ain't leaving you, Mama. I can't even stand it when you go to the bathroom. I know. I want you to come with me so you can see everybody seeing how much I love you. This boy, you're amazing. Hey, these boys' fans are really affectionate. Wow, Raven, if my man was getting attention like that. It's fine. I know the song is for me. Yeah, but they don't. Yeah, please, please. All right, all right, all right. Before we do this, I need you all to know this song is for somebody very special to me. This song is for you. That's right. It's for all of you. I love you all. Salatama baby, yeah, salatama baby, if I don't cast my baby. Now that Dr. Light is back in prison and the museum is destroyed, I wonder what we should do with this. Well, if I were you, I probably wouldn't be messing with it. Easy there, Raven. Yeah, what's got you all worked up? I'm not worked up. Oh, well, sorry. It's hard to tell how you really feel with your delivery sometimes. But you should really stop passing that thing around like a ball. You need to calm down! You are out of control! Oh, yeah, you're not mad. You are at least excited about the butt-kicking of the Dr. Light, yes? Woo. Was that excitement or your trademark use of the sarcasm? Uh, guys, I think this thing just turned on. Or something. You take it! I don't want it. Uh-uh! Whee! I love this game! Uh-oh. <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> we just split Raven into four versions of herself! Actually, there are five Ravens now. Are you sure? Cause... Go ahead, Beast Boy. We'll wait. <sighs> Zero. One, two... You don't start at zero when you count. Really? Huh. And five it is. Oh, no! We just split Raven into five versions of herself! You okay, Raven? I told you not to mess around with that thing. Ow! Free! Free! I'm free! I don't like it here. What's not to like? Mm -hmm. Uh... It seems the prism has divided Raven into the five core parts of her personality. Purple is her passion. Red is her rage. Pink, her happiness. Orange, her laziness. And gray is her timidity. Well, 
At least now we know what the ravens are thinking. This is gonna be awesome! Just think, five ravens in battle! Ah, maybe having five different ravens around won't be such a bad thing after all. Ow! Time to watch everybody's favorite action movie! Ow! It's not everybody's favorite movie, just yours, jerk! Now, the old raven would've just said whatever, but you, you say what's on your mind. I love it! Oh, and I hate it that you scream all the time! No! Good to know! Well, everyone likes horror movies, right? Just thinking about them gives me a nervous stomach. Oh, no. Message delivered. You're not gonna have to tell me twice. Perhaps a comedy? Comedies make me laugh. <laughs> Ow! What was that for? Because I love comedies. This might be the fastest we've ever come to a consensus. I'm really liking these different ravens. Metal isn't dangerous. It's a healthy outlet for aggression. Not dangerous? Do you know what happens when you play a heavy metal record backwards? Hmm? Do ya? Do ya? What's a record? None of you know what a record is? No. no. A record is an analog sound storage media format popular throughout the 1900s until it was replaced first by the cassette tape, then the compact disc, and finally the MP3. Still popular with hipsters, real DJs, and weird collectors today, a record is a flat disc with a spiral groove pattern etched onto its surface. The music on the record would play by dragging a needle over the grooves, creating vibrations which were then amplified. You're making that up. It's all true. And if you played a heavy metal record backwards, it would have dire consequences. So don't do it! That is so meta! Let's do it right now! What do I feel? Feel The most metal place of all, the metal world. Behold, metal world. So metal! Titan Zone. No, no, no. Let's uh, let's just get some smooth jazz going, okay? Smooth it all out with a, a sax jam. We are the metal now, Robin, and we follow him. You guys are righteous, but you are not metal enough. Oh no, I lost my team to the metal world. If I'm going to get them back, I'll have to metal up. What are you doing here, old man? Titans, listen! I was wrong to try to stop you from being metal. I was afraid, but I thrashed my fear. That's all great, yo, but it's too late. We got some new leader now! Be Benji, lunch, 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 lunch! Oh no, my top top! <laughs> Comedy gold! Make-believe only becomes real if you put your heart and soul into it. So you're saying we just can't hack it out? Okay, new plan. Redo the whole thing with heart and soul. Nah, man, you had your shot. Listen, Pete, we're not asking. Security! <laughs> How'd the episode go? That's real good, I bet. Yo, it stank, man. I can't believe you've made 199 good to mediocre ones. It was a lot of work for one terrible one. We're exhausted. Plus, now we have to hear from haters on the internet. This show ruined my childhood. Maybe now you can understand where we're coming from. You can't give up on us. We're as much a part of you as you are of us. What are you gonna do instead? Get real jobs? We'd love to help you, but if we did this one, then we'd have to do another one and another one. It would never stop. It's a very aggressive schedule. 
The only scenario I can imagine us doing the 200th episode is if we could put ourselves and our families in it. But that seems so self-indulgent. Yeah, something like that would push the boundaries of good taste. So, this is how we go out. In the end, we're left with the question, what is reality? Are we the real? Are Michael and Aaron real? Or are we just tiny points on one of them good fractals? The real question isn't whether or not we're real. It's, does any of this matter? Hey! Michael and Aaron must have realized we are forever interconnected! They're working on the show again! Work! 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 coming. Bummer. But why? Why? That's what carnival fish do. They croak. I told you not to get attached. <gasps> Star! Wait, look! The fish! He's alive! <gasps> he is? Oh, no. My bad. <laughs> it was just that piece of toast again. <laughs> hey, Star. You got a ghost fish haunting you. Banunu! Banunu? What does the banunu mean? Banunu! I'll look it up in the fish dictionary. It says here that banunu means friend, and friendship means no fish gets left behind. Star, the fish ghost has unfinished business, and it needs our help to free its family from the evil carnies. Banunu! My love was not enough to keep you alive, but it will be enough to right the wrongs and finish the business. Show us the way, the ghost fish. Starfire, you rescue the goldfish, we'll keep the carnies busy. Titans, go! <laughs> How about a little of the old stuff out of power? Fishies, quickly into the baggie. doesn't go to the sewer. Yeah, you just drop those fish into a bunch of poop. So, I have failed again? <laughs> <gasps> what is this? <laughs> Me 
farts! What'd I say? He's fine. He cannot be fine. The killer moth has forgotten to bathe the silky. And now it is time for your bath. Can we go now? A bath in this tub of chemicals that will mutate you into a harbinger of destruction and death. Killer moth! You will not lay another hand on the silky! Yeah, he belongs to Starfire. Too late! Wow, what a day. Race cars. Lasers. Aeroplanes. We solved some mysteries. We wrote history. Man, it's all such a duck blur. So why do I feel so bad? I don't know, man. Money was supposed to make everything better. Well, we were never happier than when we were eating out of that dumpster. We made a terrible mistake returning Silky. I think we need to spend our last few dollars trying to make up for what we did to Star. <laughs> Now destroy them, my evil beast! <laughs> oh my gosh, the you can talk, Silky. Oh my gosh, I can talk! Kill them, Silky, now! Oh, this could not have gone worse! I spent all my savings to mutate you into something really horrible, and I did this? Ah, I give up. I'm going to bed. Hey, no! You are even more adorable at this size! Thank you! I love you! <gasps> you love me? I love you! Oh, my little bumgorf, I knew it! I guess I was wrong about Silky loving you, Star. I'm sorry, guys. That's okay! I love you too! Who wants to go for a ride? A ride? A ride! A ride? I sure hope Star likes these kitties. What the? <gasps> Star? <laughs> when you're good, you get a treat. But when you're bad, you get the spray bottle. Good girl. Treats for everyone, yo. Hey, where's Raven? Oh, no. I forgot to feed her. <gasps> May I eat her? No, she's gonna have a dignified funeral. Raven. <sighs> oh, you were a great teammate but even a better fish. Now we send you back to the sea, where you can swim forever. Dude, she's not going to the sea. She's going to the sewer. May she rest in peace. Oh! <laughs> Man, Raven's dead. The place is a mess, and it smells terrible. Crime alert! Cinderblock is attacking the city. Come on, dude. Say the thing you always say. Uh-uh-uh. Aren't you forgetting something? Uh... Now? After you rub my tummy. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? I'm a good boy. Titans, go! Let's do this! <laughs> Bro, get down here! I finally understand why you guys always told me to control my animal urges. <laughs> Attack! Raven! What happened?
happened to you? Well, I was sleeping, and the next thing I know, I wake up in the sewer. I'm super mutated, and I've got cool new mutant sewer friends. Sup? Hey, dudes. Sup? Hey, dudes. Oh. Hey, dudes. Sup? Awesome. We got this. Sup? <laughs> 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 